yeah, that's Alpine great. strawberry? Fuck yeah, man. That's a great goddamn idea. I can't taste strawberry. Oh, you, so you, honestly, the, even at a half percent, this doesn't taste like strawberry. Yeah. It's mostly it's mostly just using some of the citrusy elements of Alpine strawberry. I heard that I can taste shisha strawberry and shisha strawberry is great. I agree with that. Jungle flavor strawberry. Bubble wine check. Alpine strawberry check. I have to what else? Me. What else do I need? Flavor banana. 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 All right. Banana banana check. What else do I need? I use citrus soda. Oh. Honestly, mm. all I've been vaping today is alpine strawberry, banana, guanabana, and banana, citrus soda. You had me at alpine strawberry, man. 5%. No, I'm kidding. Half percent. All right. I got banana, bubble wine, guanabana, alpine strawberry, and citrus soda. That's what I was doing. I haven't tried it with the bubble wine. Okay. Basically, all I've been, all I've been vaping today is a half a percent of alpine strawberry, 1.5% banana, 1.5% guanabana, 2.5% citrus soda. It's right. heavy on the citrus soda. Citrus soda, uh, maybe come down a little bit. You said 2.5? Yeah. That I think that's heavy on citrus soda. No, I think, I think a lot of these can be moved around quite a bit. But it's what, what I this? kind of imagine that drink to be because it, it's like you get enough of the citrus that cre- takes the orange. You kind of get a little bit of the strawberry. You get a little bit of the banana. Like, and it's mostly just citrus drink what the fuck is clerico so clerico is white wine white wine with fruits it's white wine with a bunch of fruit and like it's it's i don't think it, it's one of those i don't think it has a exact recipe because for example when i was googling it and what Nashef was showing were completely different fruits yeah, well, it's just the same for sangria. Just throw whatever fucking fruits you, you have around in there. Yeah, and instead of use white wine instead of red. Yeah, it's a, yeah, it's exactly that. But sometimes it looks like you eat the you can eat the fruit afterwards. But I'm not. That's not the drink you're drinking. But like, it just yeah, just make a make a little ten mil of that. Yeah, I'll try it by itself. And tell me where you think you'd want to go with that. And I think I need to. Ideally, you'd probably take this the citrus soda down a bit. And I don't, that's what I'm trying to figure out is how to change citrus soda to make it meld with the brute wine. But I like this as a start. And okay. there's too much citrus soda for me. I think, it, I think at this, for right now, there's too much citrus soda, yeah. It's not bad, it's just. But no, what I was saying is like, imagine that drink though. I don't own that drink. Imagine not white wine with fruit in it, Max. Yeah, like orange pineapple. It, you don't taste orange juice or pineapple juice, you just taste citrus. It's like the same kind of thing. Well, yeah, pineapple juice is pretty pineapple-y. It's aggressively citrus <laughs> yeah. soda, but right after that, it is spot on what you imagine white wine with a mixed fruit blend in it tastes like. It's got, no, like it's got a little bit of banana. It's got a little bit of strawberry. It's got a little bit of weird citrusy fruits. Yeah, the citrus soda is just obnoxious up front. No, yeah, I would take the citrus soda down for sure. Yeah, when I think about it, like it is kind of boozy, even though it's not. Like, I get, like, a wine from it. Yeah, that's why I want to add booze. I still want more booze, but it's just, like, the, the actual fruit notes was just, like, yeah, I can get the banana. I can get a little bit of the weird strawberry. I can get a little bit of the guanabana or whatever. Like, I was debating, and the thing I was thinking with the citrus soda is there's almost enough citric acid that you can kind of say, you could tell someone there's an orange in it, I think. I think like, the guanabana is too high, too. Oh, um, yeah, a little, but I kind of like it. No, I definitely like it, but it's identifiably guanabana. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, it's still it's still being itself, which is kind of not the goal. I kind of like it in there at the percentage it's at. That's because you like guanabana, right? I do. Uh, I do. Yeah, I do. I don't get that much funk from it, which gua- guanabana is very funky. For the is next version, I'd or... try maybe 1% guanabana. I think I think you can do that. There is a little tiny bit of funk, but I think the banana it's the bananas battling it. Yeah, you can yeah, use yeah. sour sop. Sour sop or chermoya will do the same thing almost, but they all have different fronts. You know? Those are both kind of thick. Well, I guess flavor is not very thick. Yeah, flavor is sour sop. But like for cherimoya, it it won't sell wine because it's just so creamy and like thick. Well, this is this is a drink. Yeah, but also yeah, it, a half a percent alpine strawberry. How much alpine strawberry do you taste? Zero. I don't taste it at all. Alpine, alpine strawberries. 
on like the exhale, you can get like a small note, but there's really not a lot of strawberry to it. No, you can bend Alpine a lot. Citrus soda, I feel though, I don't want to take it down too much is the issue. But I do want to take it down. Yeah, definitely. But where? Like 2%. Yeah, I was going to say one and a half or two. 2% yeah, one, I you, think is could, still going to show up a lot. You could do one and a half percent, but I think it's kind of, we'll do one and a half, but I think that it should still be up around two. But if you think, I mean, like, if, if you taste it, like you can kind of taste apple. Like it's very yeah. suggestive. I know. It's suggestive of just fruit juice. I just, I feel like there's one thing missing, but I don't, I'm trying, I don't know what's in there it. There is. I'm it's missing the bananas. Chunks. You can kind of get the banana on the exhale, but yeah. I think it also. The banana's mostly smoothing guanabana into not guanabana. Yeah. Yeah. Into banana ish. It's so I think you could lower that and get the banana more. But like it, if you let it sit all day, I'm getting more banana now than I did at the beginning of the day. Yeah, I can see that. I think you could get a little bit more orange out of it, to be honest. But it, like everything I'm finding is just like, yep, there's some apple, here's some banana and oranges. Anything else is like, oh, this person's adding pineapple, this person's adding grapes, this person's adding peach. Cut the citrus soda down, 1.5. And brute wine. 0.25 to 0.5 brute wine. Do you have Flavora Tangerine? I do. I have all Flavora. That's why I want to work on the Flavora. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah, that's What do you think about that idea? Uh, possibly, but I was never super impressed with the Tangerine. Yeah, Tangerine could work. Honestly, and, that's the only thing I see adding. What, for more of a citrus note? To, to make it identifiably like an orange. I think the Soursop could work or the Tangerine. Other than that, we have all of the parts here already. It's kind of... and But yeah. I, I do agree that like I could use like maybe tangerine, and maybe I'll try it with tangerine. Yeah. And just something more, and even possibly more straw, alpine. Because I can get it. I, it's, it's for me, if you let it sit all day, it's to the point where like you can get just a hint on the exhale. Which is exactly what it would do in a drink. You're not going right. to get strong strawberry. Yep, yep. But at the same time, I kind of want a little more. I, yeah, I just love <laughs> strawberry. 0.75. Yeah. All right, so we're ready. We we have this all assembled. Now it's just percentage well, game. Are we adding tangerine? I really want to. I think it'll make it better. Just like half a percent probably. Because some of these two, you might be surprised. You might want to bump it up higher than you think. What are you thinking? Uh, you could do a half percent. I'd bump Alpine up to 0.75. Banana at 1.5, citrus soda at 1.5, Guanabana at 1. And then what was fruit wine? Like half a percent ish? I might, I might bump up the banana a little bit too. And tangerine at half a percent is not going to work. That's what I'm trying to think. Now that I'm smelling it, I'm thinking like one and a half ish. Let's do 1.25. This is pretty good. It's really boozy, though. Yeah. It's really good. I think it's distracting from the fruit. I want more fruit. I want more banana, but it might calm down. That's what I'm wondering. I want more. I do want a little bit more banana. I want a little bit. I want, I, I think, taking the citric, the cit, citrus soda and the other fruits back up. Cause now, citrus soda, too? Uh, yeah, honestly, because now it, it's getting, even at a half percent, it's I'm getting mostly brew bubble wine, which I want, obviously, but it's it's like, I'm I'm getting very little of the guanabana. I'm, get, I'm, I'm not getting nearly as much of like that refined fruit that was there before. Right. Yeah, yeah. It's not as refreshing. It's, it's more in your face. But yeah, like, it's not as refreshing for sure. Yeah. I'm just afraid that the citrus soda is going to stand out again if we try to take that. I guess yeah, 2%. But- I think it's really essential, honestly. It is super essential, but I'm like just trying to find where it turns into the two and a half percent version. Are you thinking two percent or back all the way? I'm gonna add two percent. I was gonna say I'm gonna add a half a percent and let's find out. And then if it's still not there, add more. Just keep adding, because like you're not getting that delicate strawberry anymore. You're not getting like enough of that delicate banana. For me, citrus soda is kind of like. It's almost there. It might even be like 2.25. 2.25. 2.25. 2.25. 2.25. 2.25. 2.25. 2.25. 2.25. 2.25. 2.25. 2.25. 2.25. 2.25. 2.25. 2.25. 2.25. 2.25. 2.25.
I don't know, though. I feel like that's pretty close to where we want it, right? Like, without standing out at all. I get a nice booziness on the end. Mm-hmm. And I get a... um, I it, The citrus does come out more when you add that. I'd say somewhere around the 2 to 2.25, because I feel like that does make a difference. Because I taste the banana. I taste a little bit of that funk from the gu- guanabana. I can taste the orange and... I can't taste strawberry. No, well, the <laughs> strawberry is still not showing up for us at 175 too much. Like it's definitely more of a hint of strawberry, but it's about the same. Um, the only thing I really want to adjust, yeah, is just maybe the 2.25 citrus soda. Everything else is here, and it's pretty close to what I think the real thing would be. Yeah, I, the banana I, thing. I agree with you. With like, I wish it was more, but I'm also because he said the banana comes out, so I kind of don't want to touch that until we know. The okay. thing with the fruits in Eclerico is that you have not, they have to be very ripe because they are like blended in the wine, like soft fruits. You don't have sharp flavors in it. Well, that's what the citrus that's, soda is that, doing. That's what I was thinking, yeah. Okay. It takes all of those like very potent fruit flavors and turns them into a hint on the back end. Well, because yeah. all, all of these two have an element of like a citric acid note almost to them. And what you're using, the citrus soda is almost your base of just like, mm-hmm. here's a small hint of alpine strawberry. Here's a small hint of banana. And the, the way it works with guanabana is there is a suggestion of apple there, even though there's no apple in the recipe. I, I have to try that. I, I want to know your thoughts. How, how is I'm going to make it right now. You know, okay, do you use any sweetener? This I don't think, I definitely don't think, because it's going to bring those fruits more forward. So I would say this is a mix where you definitely don't want a sweetener. Yeah, if, if you use super sweet, you're, you're going to have sharper fruits for mm-hmm. sure. I, I think you could still get the fruits to come in more like that thing I was vaping earlier. I was getting a little bit more of that strawberry. And I might almost want to take that strawberry back down. Really? Possibly. Because from, from the, like this other one I was vaping all day, I was getting a little bit more strawberry on the back end. I was getting a little bit more of the fruits on the back end, basically. And I still think it's there, but I think you could have more. But I've also been vaping it all day, so I'm, my nose is probably just shot, to be honest. Fuck, this totally works. Isn't that crazy? Why? I don't know. I don't know how to explain it at all. This yeah, shouldn't taste like this. It shouldn't work. It should taste like straight up strawberry. I, I, don't, I don't get the, the <laughs> alpine strawberry. Like at all. Strong. Just a hint of it. It's fucking crazy. I don't get the cleaning product from the citrus oh. I don't know how he did it. I, I don't, I don't understand it either. I still no. think, though, I want more fruit. Yeah. Oh, too close. <laughs> the, the banana is behind. The banana Why does come out more. I'll tell you that, though. Like, the more you vape it, you'll get more and more banana. Uh-huh. I don't think you want more banana in there. No, but I want more of the strawberry. And the, the apple's a little... The suggestion of apple's less. What I get... I mean, it's, it's delicious, but... I get like an astringent, is that word? Note in the back? I think that's Maybe. a tangerine. So up the guanabana, lower the strawberry. Is that what I'm getting? And that would go know. back to what I was vaping earlier. And I think that could work. I, I think have no idea. Should, I think bump up the guanabana back to one and a half first and see what, how it, go, it goes with the strawberry. I like, that, I like that version that had guanabana at one and a half a little bit more. But this, this is crazy. It kind of works. Like dance. Well, not that works. I don't know, because the earlier version without the brute wine had a lot. I think it had more refined, nicer fruit notes of like, after, after I've been vaping it all day, it was, it, it, I liked it because you just get just enough of the banana and just enough of the strawberry, but on the exhale. So the rest, when you're inhaling it, it's just citrus drink. And then on the exhale, you can more pick out what went into the citrus drink which how is how i i haven't had i mean i've had sangria i haven't had clerico but that's how i imagine that's how i think most of those drinks are you know of like you're not getting this is an orange you're just like oh this is fruity drink and then you can start once you start eating the fruit you can pick out what it is oh wait no no i went to 1.75 going up now you want even more yeah it works Beautifully. I don't, yeah. I don't understand any of this at all because I'm thinking more guanabana, I'm going to taste more guanabana, and it's the opposite. No. I don't understand any of this. 
I, th- I think they're super underrated, but Flavora does citrus notes really well. If you use some of their weirder flavors, like Winamina Alpine Strawberry. I use Alpine Strawberry and Passion Fruit for almost every citrus. And you wouldn't think, I, I mean, Passion Fruit, yes. But I, I figured that out a while ago. It's just like Alpine Strawberry is probably the best citrus. I, I get the feeling it doesn't make any sense, but that this is a clerical not with wine, but with cider. I can and see that. We don't have any apple here. But I get that. You get that the apple feeling. taste? Yeah, you get the apple yeah. taste. I, I don't know. I, I, I like it. I get a very citrus note, a very, very high citrus note. I don't know if it should be that that high, the, the, the citrus, the lemon, lime. And maybe it go to knob and I'll back down a tiny bit. You think 1.5 was the right call? Now, now you are getting more. Of the, it's it's going to what Nashef said of like, you're getting a bit more of the citrus, but it's almost too much, and you're getting more of the guanabana now, and you're getting a little bit. You're getting a lot more of the banana, and with the guanabana, but now you're getting very little of that. Your strawberries, nothing. You're, it's gone. Mm-hmm. So it is. It's it's getting it more towards what I do want, but at the same time, it's, I think it's too much guanabana. Because I think also what I, I think guanabana and how guanabana and citrus soda go together is also what makes that citrus soda can get too high and weird. I feel like it might be tangerine too. That's a substantial amount of flavor of tangerine. Tangerine has a lot of lime. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, yeah. Mom's tempted to try it without what, tangerine. What all the citrus? Oh yeah, just get rid of the tangerine. We could try that. That that might that could be the thing. All right, so we're just getting rid of tangerine. Take the guanabana down to one point five. Yeah, I'm gonna try it without tangerine. Because I do like I do really like this. Get a lot more of the fruit. Yeah. Why? I I don't understand what the tangerine was doing before. I think it was making. Now I think it was the lime. It was the lime part of tangerine just taking over, and it was almost making it sort of like a carbonated effect. See, this is closer to what I was vaping earlier too, where it's like, no, you get, you get that hint of banana, you get that hint of apple, you get that hint of strawberry, but none of it's overpowering. Yeah, I'm happy with that. I really am. I want to see. I want to see it after a couple of days. Yeah. Yeah. Especially for the, the strawberry thing that you're talking about. But I don't know how they'll do with the brute wine. Right. All right, but here's what I want to know. Is this close to what you had in mind with the Clerico idea? Yeah, now now it is. I, I think that we have to, we need some days to see what happens. But I would love to see some contrast between the, the citrus high notes, something more in the base, selecting yeah. some base maybe. Yeah, a little bit more. Yeah, a little bit more of the banana, guanamana. 